Hi, everyone. Basil Chapman. This is the uh, Thursday edition uh, of the Tiger Financial News Network uh, 11 o'clock market update on this 26th of uh, May. We're looking at the Dow. This is a really interesting move. Are we about to get another burst to the upside? Always this consolidation that's been going on since 10.23 this morning going to continue and try to rebuild strength maybe for another move up or does it pull back? The Dow is up 450 points at 32,570. We are looking at the chance that this daily chart is going to really improve the weekly chart if by tomorrow there's it doesn't have to close. It just has to push above one penny above uh, the 32,689.14 high of last week starts a leg A, gray leg A in the week. We haven't seen that in quite a while. Looking at the S&P up very sharply as well. Uh, the Dow's up 1.5 percent. The S&P's up 1.7, up 68 at 4,047. Very nice move. This is a leg B. It's broken above all the the resistance levels. The MACD's turned up, but the stochastics only at 37 percent. The on balance volume is really struggling. So we need to see a continuation with support in the 4,023 level. Uh, looking at the QQQ, that's the index 100. Nice move up. It's solid leg B. It's stalled right at the 14-period um, moving average, but it's up 2.2 percent. That's really good. Up 647 and 297. Getting real close to that 298.302 area that I really want to see to say that the queues are finally on track again. IWM is also doing very nicely. It's up 2.2 as well, 2.2%, up $4 at 182. This is a nice move. Gold. Uh, I kind of keep looking because it's just been stuck. Yeah, it's down three points at 18.50. It's just stuck. And we discussed that in my show, the target conditions are a few moments ago, that it's it, until it can really break above the 200 period moving average resistance at 1869, uh, it's kind of stuck here for a while. But the dollar actually is not pulling, uh, going up uh, much. It's in fact down 20 ticks at 101.92. So gold, gold is just not participating like it should in the counterpoint of the dollar, but it's holding very nicely so far. The TLT, I never even discussed it in my show. Down a dollar twenty one. That means yields are coming back again. A very quick peak A, peak B, peak C. Well, we'll see what happens after this at one hundred eighteen. It's not doing all that well. Crude oil, crude oil is up three point six six. What a big move! It's breaking out at one hundred fourteen point oh two. Oh, this is looking very very good. I uh, one of the reasons why I wanted to have the oil service sector for my subscribers to open and call because this is still on fire. I'll be back tomorrow. Have a great day. Stay tuned for Larry Pizzavant and all the great programs coming up. Don't forget Tom O'Brien's workshop coming up next.